Hello guys, welcome to my channel, Next Tutorial, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you on how to transfer your uh, backup, your iTunes backup, from one computer to another. And because there's a problem I've been facing on one of my Apple iPhones, every time I try to restore my, my uh, cell phone from um, a different backup it keeps telling me iTunes could not restore the iPhone I uh, because iPhone is disconnected um, I've tried so many things and as I'm gonna show you right now in this article online it kinda tells you on how to fix your uh, that problem as if you see that screen it comes up every time you try to restore your um, device it's basically saying that your um, your your USB on your computer is probably bad. There's some steps on this article to show you on how to try to fix it. It, um, it did not fix my problem, so I'm gonna show you on this video on how to copy your um, backup to a USB flash drive from your iTunes library from one computer to another and I'm gonna show you a few steps then I'm gonna show you on how to do it on Windows computers as well the easiest way to locate that file is to open up your iTunes so you're just gonna go to your applications or if you have it on the bottom of the screen just open up the iTunes application then you're gonna go to the top left where it says iTunes then scroll down to preferences you know open this up where you see devices you wanna click on that then it's gonna give you a list of your iTunes backup click right click on the mouse then show in folder then it's specifically showing me which one of those four backups is my backup the one I wanna copy to the USB now once you located that just you can copy it to your desktop then drag it to your uh, USB same way on the secondary um, computer you're gonna do the same steps then just drag it to that uh, folder now I'm gonna show you another way to find to locate the that file so you wanna press on go then home right here I'm gonna show you on how to show the hidden files because the library folder is hidden in this uh, in this uh, page or this folder so you're gonna type in a click on command shift then the dot on the keyboard once you do that you're gonna see right here how it's gonna show the hidden files right there then you wanna go on library you click on that then you're gonna want to go on um, application support which is the third one on top double click you wanna open up that file then you're gonna look for mobile sync um, it's right there we're just gonna click on that you open up mobile sync the only folder you see is backup you click on that here you go you found your backups what you're looking for the other way I showed you in the beginning because as you see they're not named it's basically will show you the exact backup you're looking for so that way is the easiest way to identify which backup is the one you're looking for so you can copy so you plug in the um, USB um, if it didn't open both uh, pages you just click back and it takes you to it you select the backup you want to copy then just hit the copy option and once you click on that then go back to the other page where you see the your USB double click on that then right click on the mouse then you want to paste the item in that folder now make sure you get a bit um, a USB big enough for your uh, backup um, 
so it will fit if the USB is too small you, it's not gonna work to copy the backup to it um, now on Windows computers you're gonna locate the folders just like how I did on the Mac Windows 10 as you see right there um, when you open up the the page or the uh, the folder you're going to see um, let me just go back to that picture then as you see when you open it up you're gonna see a view on top you click on that then you're gonna see an option you're gonna check mark where it says head um, hidden items then it will show you the hit, uh, hidden uh, folders just a different way on Windows than the Mac OS um, Windows 7 um, I'm going to show you three different pictures, different slides. Open up the folder, then you want to go on folder and, uh, and search options. When you click on that, this will come up. Then you want to go where it says view. Then when you see hidden file and folder, then show hidden file and folder and drivers. Once you do that on Windows 7, it will show you basically all the hidden files just like you see in this uh, in that folder and same way you copy it then drag or drag it to the USB uh, flash drive uh, these are the easiest way um, to do these and um, if you found this uh, video helpful to you please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel click on the um, bell next to the subscribe button to get the notification every time we post something new and thank you guys for watching and support the channel for more videos and thank you guys take care